In this lesson, we're going to learn pattern Kibon Hyung number one. So Kibon means beginner, Hyung means pattern, and number one, meaning the first one in the set. So the Kibon patterns are in-house patterns. They are specific to each school, so they don't carry across different schools. And they address some of the shortcomings in the ITF patterns and the first few Kibun patterns help to prepare you for the ITF pattern set. So, Chumbi! So, so, breathing in through your nose, out through your mouth. Every Kibun pattern starts from ready stance, just like this. Starts and finishes in ready stance. Now, from here, what we're going to do, step out to the left and do a left middle punch. So sitting stance, left middle punch. Now, coming back to the center, stepping out to the right and right middle punch. Coming back to the center, left middle punch in walking stance. Coming back to the center, right middle punch in walking stance. Stepping backward, left middle punch in walking stance. Back to the center, right middle punch in walking stance and key up. Now a key up is just a yell. You don't speak any words when you do a key up. It is just a shout or a yell. So. Now, from here, next part of the pattern, back to center, stepping out to the left, and do a low block. Remember, the opponent is directly in front of you. Low block, counterattack with a right middle punch. Now, back to center, stepping out to the right, and do a low block, and then counterattack, left middle punch. Back to the center again. Stepping forward, left, high block in walking stance. And then from there, right, reverse, high punch with no step. So counterattacking, right? Blocking, counterattacking. Back to the center, right, high block in walking stance. Counterattack with a left, high punch. Left, reverse, high punch. Stepping back. Walking stance, middle block with the left hand. Counterattack, right, reverse middle punch with no step. Back to the center, right, middle block in walking stance. And then from here, uh, left, reverse middle punch, and key up. And that is the end of the pattern. So now from here, gmaw. Breathing in through your nose, out through your mouth. So always, the ready stance is a breathing control exercise. So it helps you prepare your breathing before you do a pattern or an exercise set, and it helps you recover your breathing after you do a pattern or exercise set in class. So very, very important. So that is the first pattern in the Kibon set. And I know it's going to take some practice and watch the video several times until you've got it all. Building it up in pieces uh, is what I find works best for me. So start out, get a little bit further, a little bit further each time until you've got it. In the next video, you're just going to see the full pattern with me doing it at the regular speed. And remember, it's not a race when you do patterns. So doing a pattern too quickly is no good. And similarly, doing a pattern too slowly is also no good because then you lose the exercise benefit of doing the pattern. But it's not a race. There is a tempo to a pattern that you should try to achieve. So neither too fast or too slow, but you'll see that in the next lesson. But this was Kibon Hyung number one.